Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we made this delicious turkey meat sauce spaghetti. Oh my goodness, just look at that cheese. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and let's get into the video. I make and sing and share and cooking tutorials. Welcome, like, comment, share, and subscribe. Welcome to the Sauce Doctor. We are take over tonight. Sauce Doctor, Sauce Doctor. Welcome back to Adrian Cooking and Food Review. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we're gonna be making a spaghetti dish. Oh my goodness, guys, I'm not a big fan of spaghetti because I don't really love pasta like that. I'll eat penne and like um, bow tie and like macaronis and stuff like that. But for the long pastas, I'm not really a big fan. But quite a few people have requested for me to do this dish today. So of course, I'm gonna put my own unique Jamaican twist to this dish. And we're gonna be using ground turkey. All right, so this is the 90-10, so it shouldn't be um, a lot of um, oils and fat in there. Um, I know someone was saying Prego is their favorite sauce, and I was talking to um, Joe's Comfort Zone. She said she loved Prego too. I never tried it, so I decided to try the roasted garlic and herb Prego, because I'm not a red sauce fan either. <laughs> we have our minced garlic, we have some soy sauce, of course, we have some jerk seasoning because you know we're gonna add a little bit of jerk flavor. We need to put that Caribbean flavor in there. We have the Sam's Choice Italia Pasta. So we're gonna be using that. We have all our spice rack over here. And then this is another recommendation by one of my good friends, Eat, Cook, and Live It Up Smile. So these are the garlic knots from Aldi's. So we're gonna be trying those out too. So we're gonna be making jerk ground spaghetti meat sauce with um, pasta and then some garlic nuts on the side. So let's get into this cooking. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you're new here. And if you're returning, thank you so much for coming back, 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 back. All right, let's get into our cooking. So guys, to make our um, meat sauce, we're gonna go ahead and cut up some onion and some peppers and we have some minced garlic. This is just gonna add a lot of flavor to our dish. Now, I know not everybody do this, but you know me, I do everything slightly differently. So we're gonna chop these up for a few minutes. I'm not gonna take up all your time trying to show you how to chop veggies because I think most people already know how to chop some veggies. We just wanna chop them in a uniform chop, okay? So we're just doing a little bit of chopping, dicing, I would say. All right, so that's what you get from your onion, from your pepper. Of course, you wanna take out your seeds and all of that. You just go in. My big old hands blocking the view. Let me move this over just a little bit. All right. And we just want to dice. You probably can't see nothing, right? <laughs> all right, so we're gonna finish chop these off camera and then we'll be right back, all right? All right, guys, so we have two tablespoons of butter and one tablespoon of oil in the pan. Now, I don't know if this is how everybody will do their meat sauce, but this is how I'm doing mine. So we're going with our onions, peppers, all of those stuff, get them all browned up. I'm not putting my garlic in yet because we don't want to have our garlic burning. So we're just going to saute these for a few. Then we're going to come back, add in our minced garlic and our ground turkey and our sauces and seasonings. This is going to be amazing, guys. Amazing. All right, so we'll be right back. All right, so now this has been going down for a few minutes. We're gonna go in with one tablespoon of minced garlic. Fold that in. Mm. The aroma's in this kitchen right now. Now we're gonna go in with our ground turkey. Just wanna break it all up. Fold it in. 
We're going to fold it all in. You know, we're breaking up our turkey. And we'll come back in just a few to season this up, okay? All right, so now we're going to be cooking our spaghetti. We're going to go in with salt in our boiling water. You want to make sure that you have enough salt in your boiling water, okay? One flavorful spaghetti. And we're going to put in about a half a pound of spaghetti. All right. I just want to make sure that part kind of um, cook a little bit and then you're going to just make sure you get all your spaghetti in the water. Okay, cook to the direction of the package, okay? All right, guys, so we're going to let this cook. We'll see you in just a few. All right, so now we're going to go in and season our turkey. We got some garlic powder, some ground jerk seasoning, and you just want to season the taste. We're going to go with some black pepper. All right. Some Badia complete seasoning. You know we can't do it without that. Some garlic pepper seasoning. Ground paprika. I told you I'm unconventional with when I'm cooking, okay? Some cayenne. A little bit of garlic salt with parsley. So this is very garlic forward. Some Cajun seasoning. And last but not least, some onion powder, okay? Then we're gonna go to two, two teaspoons of soya sauce and our wet jerk seasoning. We're gonna go in with one tablespoon. So we just wanna fold this all in. And then we're gonna come back with our prego and just turn this down on low and let all the flavors mellow together. Okay guys, so stick around because this is gonna be delicious. Just look at the beautiful color that meat has. Oh my goodness. I wish you could smell the aromas in this kitchen right now. So now we're gonna go in with our prego roasted garlic herb. And we just wanna pull this all in. We want it to be saucy too, saucy. So once we put that in and have it on low, then we're gonna come back and we're gonna taste this and see how it tastes. And if it need any more seasoning, we want it to be jerk forward too. So we might add a little bit more of that jerk in there. Mm. Oh my, my. We're gonna use jerk, but we ain't gonna use no sauce doctor in here today. <laughs> you know sauce doctor make everything better, but just gonna leave it on the side today. But look at that. Mm. All right, guys, so we're gonna let this simmer on low for about five to seven minutes. And then we're gonna come back and see if it needs any more seasonings, all right? So this right here is 24 ounces of the Prego roasted herb garlic sauce. And then it's one pound of ground turkey 90-10. So, you know, for that nice lean, but I think it needs just a little bit more of that jerk flavor. I don't wanna to put too much, so we're gonna put in another half of a tablespoon. So now that's one and a half tablespoon. We're gonna go in with just a few more splashes of that soya sauce. Let's look at that. Oh my, my. We're gonna go in with a little bit of dried parsley. If you have fresh, fresh would be best. And then just a little bit more garlic salt with parsley. Okay, we're gonna let this go for a few more minutes and then we're gonna come back and plate this up for you. Our pasta is almost done too. Oh my, my, look at that. Mm. All right, so now we're gonna be plating this up. Oh my, my. We're gonna go on with our noodles. We did toss them in a little bit of butter. So you just want to kind of twist your noodles a little bit for a little presentation. All right, 
And then we're gonna label on our delicious turkey meat sauce. Oh my my. Mm. We still wanna see a little bit of our spaghetti. So we're just gonna ladle it in the middle for a little bit of presentation. And then we have some Gouda cheese. We're gonna just shred that on. Let that melt. Mm. Just look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Ooh. All that cheese. Wow. All right, guys. So we're gonna be right back to take our photo and get our slow-mo going on. Woo. All right, guys, so here's our finished product. Just look at that. Mm. Look at all that cheesy goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, look at that garlic nuts. Woo. Guys, this is heaven right here. I know I'm gonna enjoy this. So stay tuned for the part two, which is gonna be the mukbang. Woo. So guys, I wanna say thank you so much for watching. If you like the content and you've been here before and you still haven't hit that subscribe button, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Turn on your notification bell so that you don't miss a brand new upload. And as always say, share with your friends, share with your family, share with your neighbors. Don't be selfish because they wanna be a part of this fun and personality. Don't click out the video just yet because you wanna be serenaded by the one and only Silas Mukbang. Thank you, thank you. All right, guys, love you all. See you later.